In a documentary credit, the importer and exporter banks act as intermediaries and conduct the exchange of documents for payment in a trade transaction. Typically, the documents include the commercial invoice, the bill of lading, and other documents required for customers' clearance, and the collection of goods such as the certificate of origin or the inspection certificate. There are two types of documentary collections, documents against payments and documents against acceptance. Under the terms of documents against payments, the buyer is required to pay before receiving documents from the collecting bank. The exporter prefers this option to ensure receipts of funds before the goods are released to the importer. Under the terms of documents against acceptance, the buyer can take delivery of goods on acceptance of a bill exchange and payment occurs at a future agreed time. The importer prefers this option so they can use this opportunity to delay payment and access extended finance. However, in the case of documents against acceptance, the exporter faces a risk of non-payment by the importer on the maturity date of the bill of exchange. This can be mitigated by requesting the importer's bank to avalize the bill exchange. Avalizing means that the importer's bank must pay on the maturity of the bill of the exchange, even if the buyer is unable to or unwilling to pay. Therefore, the exporter is exposed to the bank's risk instead of the importer's risk. In addition to handling your trading documents, BOA can also support both importers and exporters, working capital needs when they use documentary collections. Importers can obtain financing from the time they have to pay the exporter to the time they are able to realize proceeds. From the sale of goods and exporters can obtain financing until payment is received from the importer's bank. Contact your BOA relationship manager or trade specialist to understand how documentary collections can support your business needs.